think you should be Hey guys, Captain Crush here, and today we are filming episode 7, continuing our adventure mode. <laughs> Hello. <laughs> Hi, Misty. Um, today we will be taking on this gym, the third gym, trying to get the water badge. And after that, we will be taking on Tess and Jake. Alright, so let's see how we match up against the water gym. Many of you guys were commentating that I should have picked a different starter. Um, I like Chikorita, and I kind of picked Chikorita for this gym anyways. Um, so for this, we have to move this like puzzles and just make a match so it's all flush. And all you do is click the little steering wheel one time, and it'll make the water fill up. Alright, so now moving on to the first trainer. I figured out the first pipe um, work puzzle. Good job. Now let's see if you can beat the first gym trainer. So we got a tentacool. So let's hope a pedal dance can take it out. And it won't. Acid spray is going to hit us pretty good. Lower our special defense. Pedal dance. We'll take down the tentacle. We're not confused. So depending on what it sends out next, I'll leave Chico in. Horsey. Perfect. We can take out a horsey. Pedal dance will take down the horsey. Super effective. All right, and Flipper grew a level. Tentacruel, so yes, we will send in Kurama. Psyshock. And down goes Tentacruel. Kurama grew to level 41. Awesome. Thank you. He said I'm really smart. I got a compliment. Yay. Alright guys. Um, the second one's a little bit trickier. So what you're going to want to do is... Let's see. We'll leave this one. This one. So you're going to want to put this here. This one's going to want to go here, 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 okay, like this, like that, and like that. This is the path you want to take to make sure all the uh, ones match up. And turn on the water and you will be able to move on. Awesome. So now we can take on our second trainer. Let's see what he got. Um, okay, Whalmer. Pedal Dance should do a lot of damage. Alright, so now Mantine. I think we should be able to get it down to half damage. Wide Guard, that's fine. And Pedal Dance will take down the Mantine. Mm -hmm. 
All right, so Chico is doing work in this gym, making it look easy. All right, so now on to our final one. Okay, this one is a bit tricky. I want to say it goes like this. Um, let's see. All right, so this will go now. Okay, this one can go there. This one goes there. That one goes there. This one goes there. Then we have the long one, the turning one, this one. This one, this one. Um, this one will go here. This one can go there. And the final one goes back where it belongs. And that is the path you need to take, guys, for the final puzzle in the water gym. Pretty cool, pretty cool. All right, so it looks like we have two more trainers before we hit the gym leader. So let's go ahead and take them on. Hello. All right, so we have Chico against the War Turtle. So let's pedal dance. And down goes War Turtle. Uh, now we got print, print Blub. And we should take it down with the pedal dance. Alright, growing levels everywhere. Marsh top. Yes, let's get some or no, we can we can finish it off. Let's just razor leaf. Hopefully we don't get hit with confusion. And magical leaf will take down the marsh top. Awesome. Alright, so final trainer before we get to the gym leader. Ooh, a Lapras. Awesome. I can't wait till Lapras comes out in this game. So we can pedal dance and hopefully one hit the Lapras because it's very tanky. And we do. Add a boy Chico. So Chico looks to be taking on the whole gym by himself. Doesn't need any heals. All right, so let's save here just in case. All right, time for this guy. Hello, young trainer. I am Quentin, the leader of the Rose Cove gym. Uh, you must be the kid that ran Team Eclipse out of town. Word spreads fast around this town. I'm sure that uh, you're here now to test your strength. I warn you, water types my specialty. They're uh, some of the oldest living species on the planet. Millions of years. Um, you must have beaten all of those Team Eclipse members. You must be strong to beat all of them. Uh, but you are strong enough to take on. But are you strong enough to take me on? I think so, Quentin. I like your hat. It looks like the Hogwarts hat, the the sorting hat. All right, so we got a Whalemer. Wilmer. Level 35. Pretty, 
pretty decent level. Wonder if Chico can one hit it. And Chico does. Down goes Wilmer. I believe he has a the two eel Pokemon next. Gorb yeah, Gorbis and then the uh like the I don't know what the other one's called. So down goes Gorbis with a critical hit at a boy Chico. And we didn't get confused, so we can hit the other one as well. Flipper grew to level 38, Hyper Voice. We'll get rid of Pound for Hyper Voice. Kurama grew a level. Kurama wants to learn Flamethrower. Is Flamethrower better than Mystical Fire? Lowers opponent's special attack. I like I like the, the power though. I don't care about lowering their attack or special attack. I just want power. So 90, 90 power will be a lot better. Huntail, there we go. And Chico will most definitely one hit the Huntail. And that is a GG. We did it. Chico wants to learn light screen. Um, no, thank you. Nash go to 41. He wants to learn mud shot. All right, let's see. 95 accuracy. I think we're good with this. And all right, luck license get us eleven hundred dollars. All right, so let's see what TM he's gonna give us. Probably, we got the float badge, guys. All right, level fifty, we can control TM fifty five. Scald. All right, perfect. We got scald, guys. We beat you, just let us go. Let us walk out of here. Oh yeah, oh yeah, oh yeah. We out, we out E500. Well, look who it is. Evil, evil. What a surprise when you master crush. I was in the neighborhood and came to talk to the man about some Pokemon related issues they were having. I heard a couple of men were Team Eclipse tried stealing your necklace and chest metal. I was very fortunate that you managed to escape. I bet your Pokemon are very strong now. Looks like you have three badges. You're coming along quite well. Anyways, I've always wanted to tell you that I haven't gotten any word regarding your parents yet. According to a few sources, it would appear Team Eclipse definitely has them. It's unclear what they are keeping them. Uh, they've been giving the people of Roria a few years now, but based on their operation, never found. It's odd they've, um, in the past, they've been keeping their villainous attempts down low. They've been attacking populated areas in large, large numbers. I've had guests they are getting close to whatever it is they're after. Uh, da -da -da -da, rumor spread, particularly ancient Pokemon to create a unique power. Probably Hoopa. Alright, we're gonna just push on through this. Kyogre and Groudon are great. We have nothing to fear. Team Eclipse attempt another legendary has failed. Well, I must get going. I need to run to the Pokemon Center real fast. Uh, be safe and stay out of trouble. Oh, why did I, why did I go back inside here? Alright, let's go to the... Do, 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 do. Time to take on Jake and Tess. Alright, 
Alright guys, so we're gonna heal. And then we're going to... Take it... Give it to Chico. We're gonna level up Flipper. that everyone's around the same level usually you have like one pokemon that you're like oh no you know like they're super strong like they're taking out everyone and it's good we have the experience share i highly recommend it for you guys all right so now we are here and let's talk to jake and tess oh look master crush is here now uh how was the gym water type pokemon are okay but my ideal type is dragon um I would go fight the gym leader, but I'm more interested in the adventure. Yeah, me too. Do you have a couple of badges? Um, so who's ready to move on now? Still much to see. Um, we still haven't found Mr. Crush's parents. Oh yeah, Jake was telling me about your parents. It's awful. Uh, I can help you in any way I can. That's so nice and beautiful. I'm what? Uh, <laughs> I said you were so bored waiting here around here. Let's go on ahead. Yeah, let's go. Uh, we'll see you on the other side. Come through when you're ready. I be looking like a man when I walk through. Alright, time to battle. Alright, Master Crush is here, we're all ready to go. Actually, before we go anywhere, I would suggest something. we do something first. We, I know you are both tough trainers, but I'm curious which one of you is stronger. Oh, that would be me, of course. Right? <laughs> Actually, I want to see you battle each other. Winner of you can beat me, then I'll know that you are, without a doubt, very strong trainers, I guess. But I wasn't prepared. Ooh, don't call me scared. <laughs> Captain Master Crush seems fine with it. Well, in that case, we should have a battle. Sorry, Master Crush, but I won't go easy on you. This will be exciting. Cheering for you both. All right, let's do this. All right, Jack. Look at him. Look at him with his dumb face. Vaporeon! Let's go, Flipper. All right, let's try out our new attack, Hyper Voice. Didn't do much. Or Beam's not going to do much either. Uh, you can't run. <laughs> no. What if we were allowed to run? Disarming voice didn't do much either. Oh, Aqua Ring. In that case, let's go for Chico. <sighs> Acid Armor. Yeah, that's gonna be a hint in our plan. Too bad we got Petal Dance. Alright, so down goes Vaporeon. Need a Reno. Okay, so we can bring out Gurama for that. We'll just Psy Shock it. Down goes Need a Reno. Baby Dirt grew to 43, and Zeb Striker. Um, let's go with Timmy. Timmy hasn't gotten any play, so he needs to come out and play. Alright, let's Swift. Spark's gonna hit us pretty good, and paralyze us, and watch our luck be that we get paralyzed. Of course. Alright, Timmy. Swift. Flame charge. Raising your speed. And we're paralyzed again. Isn't that lucky? If we're paralyzed one more time, we're just going to switch into dirt. And... Oh my god. Three... Did you guys see this? Three paralyzes 
in a row. That is that is ridiculous. It is all kinds of ridiculous. Too bad you can't hit us hard. And leftovers. Alright, so we're gonna take him out with the or let's just use muddy water. He's just raising his speed is all he's doing. And we'll finish it off with the mud slap. Pursuit's not gonna do much. Mud slap will take out the Zip Striker. Timmy better grow a level. <laughs> there we go. Level 40. Slowpoke, yes. Um, let's go Chico. And then we can just go Magical Leaf. Alright, so down goes Slowpoke. <laughs> that was unexpected. We got 2400. Such a great match. Uh, I did very well. It must be very strong. Challenge you, Mr. Master Crush. Hope you're ready. Won't go easy like Jake did. Well, it kind of sucks that I brought my fairy to the dragon party. Rip. Level 39 out of Boy Flipper. Alright, Shogun should go down without a hitch. So in future, she's going to have a nice critical hit. I was like, wow, are we going to take it out? She's going to have a Salamence and a um, Garchomp in the future. So once we get to her later on. Oh, and she'll have a uh, Haxorus as well. Haxu is so cute. Too bad I had to smack it. <laughs> Did I lose already? Yeah, I only took three attacks. Alright, if I was going to be capable, well thanks Jake, anyways now for a little more about me, I hope, um, one of my hopes is setting out on this adventure with you as I become a real Pokemon trainer. I want my Pokemon and I to grow strong together, I know, well, I know you'll be great. Jake, stop sucking up. <laughs> thanks Jake, uh, don't mention it. Where to now? Uh, you said Team of Close has your parents, I think I might know someone that can help. He's an old friend of my grandpa's and his way in Roria, he kept us around for your Team Eclipse. Um, does your friend live? He lives in the capital city of Roria, Anthean City. The giant, there's a gym there, I've heard. Oh my. I always wanted to visit it. Wonder things about it. Uh, are you excited too? Wait, what? You've never heard of it? Can't believe it. Well, you're for a big surprise. Don't want to spoil anything for you. Uh, just wait till you get there. <laughs> Don't want to spoil anything? Like what? There's going to be a city in the sky? <laughs> Alright, how do we get there from Route 9? Just travel the forest and then we get to Route 10. To Kraken off cliffs. Da -da 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 -da. Ghost type Pokemon scare me. Not afraid of good ghosts. I'm not scared of good ghosts. I'll fight them off, no problem. Well, that's kind of you. Since we're in the woods, we should train. Let's meet back in a little bit. Alright. Gucci. So we meet a wild sea waddle. Alright guys. Um, 
through this door over here uh, is the Grove of Dreams. Like I was saying, um, next episode we will be adventuring the Grove of Dreams as well as the... See if we can go without running into any trainers. Um, we're going to be going through that area. There's an area over here. It'll be um, in the next episode as well. It'll be the Haunted Mansion. I will show you guys how to get the Jirachi over here in the Grove of Dreams. As well as how to get Rotom uh, from the Haunted Mansion. And this tree is, I believe, um, one of the legendaries. I think Xerneas or something, or Evolta, one of them. I forgot which one the, um, the people were saying. Um, also, this is another place to get myth a mythical. This right here, this person. Um, I love flowers. They give off sweet scent. Plus, they're absolutely beautiful. I've heard that these um, precious Pokemon called Flabebe um, that share my love for flowers. Not only that, there's five different color variations of these Pokemon. It's been my dream to see all five colors and, uh, and or any of its evol evolutions. I would do anything to see them, even uh, reward them for bringing them to show me. I collect rare and beautiful flowers. I wouldn't mind sharing them for my collection. Let me know if you ever come across one of those. So this lady right here, she's the lady who will be giving you a um, Gracidia flower. Once you bring all five of the um, fl Flabebes, I believe, fr from the evolutions. Um, let's see if I have it in the Pokedex. A lot of people just use the flo Floet because they're, e they're the ones easiest to catch. Um, let's see. Floet, Floet, Floet. Um, I don't think we have it in our Pokedex. Oh, right here. These ones, which will be found in the next route. Um, once you collect, see this one is red. There's red, white, blue, yellow, and orange, I believe. And once you get all five of them, or you get uh, one of these ones, the uh, Florgus or the uh, Flabebe, which is the one she was talking about. If you get all the five different color variations, she will um, reward you with a Gracidia flower. And once we um, are rewarded with a Gracidia flower, I will then show you how to get Shaman. So in this area, there's um, a problem. There's a uh, a lot of it's, it's basically the bridge to three of the uh, mythicals. That can be found. Like I said, this one's Shaman. The Grove of Dreams straight across over there is Jirachi. And the there's a little route on the other side of this wall to the Haunted Mansion. And that'll be how to get Rotom. Alright, we're going to end this episode here, guys. Um, I will be doing the other episodes uh, later on. Also remember that... We are in Route 9 right now, and through those doors is Route 10, which will lead us to the um, the Kragonos Cliffs, which will lead us to the new city, which we can then go ahead and get our fourth badge. So for now, we got our third badge. Really happy about that. Uh, moving up, fourth gym will be a lot better. Um, I believe it's a flying gym because the city is in the sky. So yeah. If you guys have any questions, go ahead and leave them down below in the comment section. Don't forget to like the video. Don't forget to subscribe and follow us on Twitter. We will see you in the next one. Bye, guys.